All right. I gotta find my charger. I'm a mess, but that's okay. Oh, Jesus. We're fine. Okay. Hey guys. Oh, I just forgot to clean up her garbage. Okay. I'm so up. Mm -hmm. Hello, everybody that's awake at very late at night. <laughs> How is everyone? Are you guys, are you good? Is there anybody here? <laughs> Hello. Um, yeah, there's some. <laughs> there was people here. I chased them away. They're like, oh, she's coming finally. Hey, Teresa, oh, Denise, yeah. other oh, Denise. Teresa's awake still? I don't know. Wow. Yeah. I feel honored. She's never awake this late. Alright. Hello. Hi. Hi. Oh, there's ten people here? Holy cannolis. Hey guys. Um, I gotta just set up a little bit, so just give me a moment. Hi babies. Oh, get down. Let's just pause it. I know I'm here. Calm down. Hi, you're okay. Hi, Sandra and Joyce. Come on here. Let's go take our shoes See, you got to remember also on the West Coast, we're not, you know, as late. Yeah, it's not that late on the West Coast. <laughs> hey, Joanne. Hey, everybody. Hi, Ed. Is everybody waiting for the raid on? <laughs> <laughs> she advertised raid on. Oh, yes, she did. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm just grabbing some things. Hi, Jess. Ow. Yes. Yeah, Jess. Oh, like you left all your trash down here yeah. at my desk. Makes it hard to go live with all this garbage laying around here. Mm hmm. Miss Hey, Elizabeth. Alrighty. I'm almost ready here. I just need a few more minutes, guys. I'm sorry. No worries. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> oh. That's just dangerous. Maybe we won't do that. Maybe I'll stop with that. Okay, that would be good. So, so who's Hello. All right, I'm grabbing one more and thing in the bowl. So we'll be good. Oh, I need a notebook. I don't have a notebook. His juice. I don't know. I have my pen. I don't have a notebook. I'll just have to transfer from this paper here. All right. Mm. I got my list of people who've got to go out tomorrow and some other things. I've got some new radon items, some hard goods, and some stones. I'm going to crick in my neck. Oh. Hi, Kara. Dude, Kara, the whole gang is here now. <laughs> okay. I can't believe Christy's still awake. It's crazy down. Oh, you're awake. I'm drinking coffee. She's drinking so, yeah. coffee. Hey, Joanne. All right. I'm going to definitely stay Bye. caffeinated. Gotta keep it separated. Oh. Here's my list for shipping. 
Duran, I've never heard of William White. Is, who's that exactly? Duran, <laughs> she's discovered a new celebrity you guys probably already know. Isn't it a band? She said William it's White. Oh my. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Is he a looker, Joanne? I go to bed. I took a nap. You should have gone take a nap. You gotta go to bed. I go to bed. You can't be in there. I'm working. Okay. My glasses were super dirty. Okay. I'm pulling up my channel because I know eventually Chrissy's gonna have to go. And there we go. I mean, it only took me five minutes to get my shit together. Oh, God. Really? Okay. Is William White the TikTok guy? He's a TikTok guy? Tick tick. He's a tick tick guy. He makes beautiful jewelry with stones. No kidding. Oh, okay. oh interesting. I, I just Googled, so I'm just like, hi. Hey. I don't know. Okay. Are we ready to party? We're ready to party. Or half party. <laughs> I'm sorry it took me so long to get here. Um, a family friend, Andy's best friend's uh, mom passed away last night um, of cancer after her nine and a half year battle. And so we went... Um, we went to just hang out with them for a bit and uh, um, console them and just, just generally be there. And uh, we just stayed a little bit longer than I meant to. So now I'm here. I am back. Uh, Andy's family is here and is staying with me. I will still be alive every night. Uh, not this late. <laughs> this was a, a little bit of an accident. So we are going to get... I'm just going to jump into it. Um, I think we'll probably just do two back and forth. And we'll probably for sure be on for an hour. And then, you know, depending on how it's going, how it's going, I know it's super late at night. Um, we'll depend on if we stay on any later or if we're just going to be on for an hour. Okay. Hey, at least you're here. Yes, I'm here. And I got Let's go. All right. Um, first thing, this is a buy it now. It is a rose quartz stone bowl. It is twenty dollars. Nice egg shaped bowl. Nice little stony baby here. He is twenty dollars. And what are you doing, baby? You little. And then the second thing I'll do uh, this is eight dollars and this is a a gold stone worry stone. It's eight bucks and I only have one of these left. And this is just what I have next to me and then uh, if anyone wants either one of those just let me know. I'm gonna let Gina go, and then on this next round, I'll show you some uh, some redone stuff, and then I've got hey, some clowns. as well. All right, I've got some clowns. These clowns are gonna be a six dollar start choice. Six dollar start, your choice. If there's any interest in clowns, my brain went to the song "Send in the Clowns." <laughs> First one here, she's got her hands behind her back. Kind of looks like a female. Second one here, he's got an umbrella. Is it pottery and ceramic? Yeah, they're both ceramic, I think. This one has a little hole in the back, but there's nothing on the bottom to like. Oh, Joanne, you're a clown tree. She has a clown. Oh. <laughs> oh, and there is a chip on his umbrella. 
And I actually just noticed a chip down here. I didn't even look at his feet before. There are some chipping down, some chipping down here. Oh look, he's got his toes exposed. How cute. Whew. And what would you say that was? That would what as well? $6, $6 choice. Hi, Pat. Hi, Kara. Hey, Patty. She says she's trying to scale back her clouds. <laughs> totally understand. All right, my second item, I've got some fossilized starfish left and their $10 start choice. $10 start your choice. Fossilized starfish. Oh, I'm sorry, Jess. Mm -hmm. I have never seen something like that. That's really? so cool. <laughs> Julian, you're trying to scale back your clowns? <laughs> scale back clowns? How many clowns do you have? She's got too many. She's got a lot. <laughs> Few. You got too many. All right. Well, that was my two. Thank you. Alrighty. I'm gonna show a couple of Ray Dunn things. Um, I did pick up another free spirit mug. The nice blue one, in case somebody wanted it and they didn't get a chance to get it. These are fifteen dollars. Um, so if you want this, just tell me you want the blue mug. I just picked that up in case somebody wanted a second one because they didn't have any more when I was there the first time. Uh, but when I went back the next day, they put some more out, so I grabbed it. Um, Kara, I don't know. I have in-laws in right now, and so I haven't been super checking my email. Um, I also have to catch up on uh, shipping from before I left of stuff that I'm trying to get out. So I will be getting caught up in the next few days. Everything's just been super hectic. So be patient with me, <laughs> please. So this is going to be, Elizabeth, you said those are so cool. And then you said Gina question mark. I just want you to know what we can see in case you said something and it disappeared, okay? Um, this is a butter dish. It's a Ray Dunn butter dish. I'm gonna do a $25 start on this. It's a very big butter dish and it says brunch. And it's quite large. It's a big butter dish. So could you fit like two or three sticks in there? At least two, probably. Yeah, you could fit like four sticks stacked on top of each other. Oh, there you go. Oh, <laughs> yes. She wanted the free spear mug. Do you want the free spear mug, Gina? Oh, I forgot about that. No, that's okay. Because I ended up getting the um, dreamer one. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'll grab it. No one does. Um, Kara, I'll have to look into it, but I know for sure that I put um the camel and the silver earrings in there. And I, I thought I remembered to put the leggings in there, but I did have them hanging up in here. So I could have forgot to throw those in there. Um, But I know you've got the other stuff because I don't have anything else for you. Like, I don't have anything in packages for you. Um, the only thing I have here is some towels that you claimed last time that you haven't paid for yet. 
because I have an invoice for him. Like it's on anything. But I'll look and see if I find the leggings. But uh, we'll talk about it in email. Okay. Now, this is a $25 start. It says Brent. It's 25 bucks. If you would like it, let me know. Put it to the side. And then my second item will be this guy. This is a $10 start. It's a Ray Dunn little dish for like your, your pet food or water. And it says perfect. Which is a little dish. They had a super cute one that I wanted to get. I don't remember what it said now, but it had a big crack out of it. What are you eating? Hey, Michelle. Oh, from the thing? Don't eat all of them. Well, you can you can have one bag out of each of it. And that's it. There's six in each. Okay, you can have one out of these one another. Those are really expensive. Okay. So this guy is ten dollars. You've already got Elizabeth in the can. Sweet, thank you. It is adorable. Okay. Well, if there's no other interest, we will call it to Miss Elizabeth. And then if anybody wants the free spirit mug, the blue one, or um the brunch butter dish. Let me know. <clears throat> All right. I've got some stone mushrooms. Um, they are 10 and 12. The small one is 10. The large one is 12. Buy it now is fine. The green one is a green fluorite. And the $12 one looks like rose quartz. Although it's kind of clear. Yeah, I think it is a really light pink. But cute little mushies. What were the two prices? Ten and twelve. Yes, they look very phallic. <laughs> All right, if anyone's interested in those, just let me know. Hi, Kara. Are you just saying hi, or are you talking about something I, that I missed? All right. I just said I didn't forgot about you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, I have this blue kyanite on quartz matrix. Big, beautiful piece. It's $25. To $25, buy it now. Beautiful chunk to display. Blue kyanite on quartz matrix. Yes, Michelle, it is. It's a pretty like teal green. <laughs> Samantha Joe, is that your cat's name? It's so cute. Oh, dude, I thought you were talking about the YouTuber Samantha Joe. Right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I go back and forth on watching her and not watching her. 
right now I'm kind of like watching her, but I'm not subscribed, but I'm watching her still. So. All right, and this is my second item. If anyone's interested, just let me know. Yeah, I spelled that right. No, but that's okay. <laughs> well, you get the chance. It's a, you're close, just an A instead of an O. So, I've got this recipe box, and it comes out like this, with the recipes in there, and then you close it back up, and it like sits on your counter. If anyone would be interested in that one, just let me know and I'll show it. Um, but I do have that guy. So I've got one redone thing left. It is a mug. It is $15. It says New Beginnings, and it's yellow on the inside. Hey, cha, cha So it says new beginnings, and it's yellow. How much was the recipe box? 15 bucks for this guy, and then the recipe box I haven't given a price yet. So it's 15 bucks for the mug. I swear I meant mug, not bug. Hey, Amy. Leanne! So it says new beginnings, and it's yellow on the inside. Hey, Ad. You want the butter dish pot? You got it. I'll write you down for it. So I've got these. The only ray done I've got left tonight. I only have four pieces. I'm sorry. I didn't pick up a ton. Um, I've got the New Beginnings mug and the Free Spirit mug that's blue. So if anyone wants either one of these, let me know. They are 15 a piece. And then for my second item, I'm going to try to break my printer. I love that. I've got this Rose Quartz Heart Bowl. And it is $25. I got you, Pat. You want the butter dish? Got you loud and clear. This is a rose quartz heart shaped stone bowl and it is $25. For comparison, I think I have like a moo kite one that's this size that's like 35. I got a really good deal on some bowls, so this guy's only 25. So if anybody wants this guy, it'll be 25 bucks. And then I'm going to send it back on over to Gina. Every time I say your name, I have to stop myself from saying it in, like, Gina. <laughs> yeah, my cousin used to call me that. I thought he was cute. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a little cute. <laughs> All right. I've got some blue fluorite specimens. They're really pretty. They have a lot of sparkle on them. And they're $13 start choice. This is number one, 13 start choice, blue fluorite specimen. They both have some sparkle on them, so let's sparkle. And then here's number two. Number two doesn't have as big of a like uh, crystal in like on the matrix, but it does have a lot of sparkle on it, a lot of like large crystals on it. Hey, Cha Cha. That's number two. If anyone's interested, just let me know. Um, I still have an angel or a heart left. This is a $20. Buy it now. Hi, Amy.
got like a little bump. It's got a little raised area there. Angel Aura Quartz. It's clear quartz. It's been co uh, coated in an Aura coating. It has a flat bottom, so you can set it down on a table, display it. Yeah, those hearts are really cute. Yeah. What did you do to him? What? Well, what did you touch on him? Well, my cat doesn't react like that. So that guy's 20. If anyone's interested, just let me know. Okay, my cat's okay. He made this like really weird noise and then like basically. Oh, no. he, okay. he doesn't do stuff like that. It's not normal. Um, so this big rescue box is twenty bucks. It's just gonna be a twenty dollar by now. It is a big recipe box. It's in the shape of a birdhouse, and it has beautiful, cute little um hand painted vegetables on it, which is so cute. <laughs> Whoops, I just threw it down and almost broke it. Love that. And there's the top of it. So it's 20 bucks. It is a good, decent size. I'm trying to, I wish I could get it to just rest flat and then open, but it's a little wobbly. So it sits flat like this, and then you pull it out. And it has these compartments for your like index cards for your recipes, and then you just put it back in. Uh, it's super cute. Bye, Chacha. -cha. Keeps everything organized that way. Oh yeah, and it's so cute. I love the little hand painted details on it. It's adorable. So let me know if anybody wants that guy for twenty bucks. I'm gonna put that there so I don't worry. And then, if you don't have one yet and you really wanted one, I got a couple extra black obsidian little fat rhino guys. These guys are twenty five bucks. Um, and these ones are like chunkier than the other ones I had. So I've got two available. If you want one, let me know. I got one. Their horns are really big. And they cute little feetsies. And then number two. They are adorable. Back by popular demand. Sweet. He's adorable. Mm -hmm. Um, Pat, I don't remember. Um, just message me again or, or send me an email and we'll figure it out. So if anybody wants any of that, let me know and we'll pop it back over to Gina. That's it. Um, she, give her a few minutes. Oh. She's not back yet. Okay. Well, then I'll show something else. Um, that's okay. You just throw it up there. So I did get some more Baby Yodas in if anybody wants one. I've got a big one with black obsidian eyes for 40 And then I've got some smaller ones that are just green adventuring um, that are 25 So if you want some little short Baby Yodas, they're 25 and then if you want a bigger one, I've got one bigger one left, and he is 40. So if you want a baby Yoda, let me know. Hi, kitty, get out of my stuff, baby. Let me grab what I got in here. Um, I got a pair of Ugg shoes, if anybody wants to check those out. Hey, Pam and Bean. What's up, girl? Oh, and I picked up this wallet for myself. It's super cute. And it's brand new. I don't know what it's Mantina. What's it say? Manatee? No. Man 
Terra authentic approved goods. Oh, it's made from 100% recycled board. Oh, maybe just the tag. Anyways, I got a wallet for myself. I was checking to see if there's anything in here I've got for sale. I've got... I think I bought that sweater for myself. And that cup is for me. Okay. All right. Um, Pat, I think I have everything for you wrapped up. So... Is there any sign in there? Or maybe I don't. Is it right here? Okay, I got it. Okay. So if anybody wants a pink Mother of the Bride mug, it's 15 bucks. Let me know. It's up for grabs now. I thought I wrapped everything already, so we're good. So if anybody wants the pink Mother of the Bride mug, it's 15 Let me know. And I'll do these next. These are, I don't know what size they are. These are like satin slippers with butterflies on them. Michelle needs a small baby Yoda, please. You got it, Michelle. Thank you so much, love. I'll pick a cute one for you. Not that they're all not cute. So these are satin slippers. You get one pair of satin slippers. And it says they are a woman's one size. So I think they fit most people. They are from Pier 1 Imports. And they are satin slippers. They come in a nice purple bag with butterflies on them. And these will be a $15 start. They are brand new. And here are the slippers. There's like a nice house slipper. And they've got this really pretty butterfly design on them. Oh, it was just, it's a house slipper, though, because they're squishy. <laughs> yep, they are one size. And they come in a nice little satin bag. You could use it for a wedding gift. So, it's weird that they're a one size. I think they're like a 10 or 11. Hey, it's the month for weddings, you know. That's fine. I don't know why. I think they're like, they're like a, they're an 8 or a 9. I don't think they're any bigger than that. I think they'll go up all the way to 10. So she, so like up to a size 10 on the slippers. So up to a size on the slippers, they are new and they do come in a nice little bag and they are satin. So if anybody wants some cute satin slippers, they're a beautiful purple color with butterflies on them. It is a super cute gift for somebody. Let me know if you're interested and I got you. And oh, let me write Michelle down for her. You sure you don't want both, Michelle? <laughs> Her little girl might freak out. She's a stone collector. I think she would oogle and ogle too much. I am picking the out of you, there. Christy, let me know when uh, Gina's back, will you? Sure. She uh, put it in the the cat. Oh, okay. I just wasn't uh, I haven't looked at it. Um, do you want the really fat baby Yoda? The skinny one? Or like the medium sized one? 
there's one that one is like super thick thick boy Okay. I can keep going. So, Michelle, you tell me what baby yoda do you want. And then I've got this. I got an egg. And my sister in law's here. This is $8. Uh, just as my sister in law, that's who's in here. Um, this so this is eight dollars. It's an egg. Um, gifts from the heart. Something treasures. It's got its tag on it. Still, it looks like this. It's like a decorative egg. It's covered in like felt and suede, and it opens, and it has like a satiny inside. So it'd be good for like if you have really nice eggs and you don't have anything to put them in. Or you want to hide your stone treasures. Yeah, you can put stone eggs in here. Or you can put whatever you wanted in here. You could put a really nice necklace in here. You could put your pearls in here. Like if you have a really big pearl necklace and know where to put it, you could put it right in here. It's like, oops, like decorated. Yeah, this probably had like an egg with it at one point. I just had the container now. Stash. Yeah, you could put your money in there, but you know, I don't know. And I don't know if it used to like be able to hang at one point, but it's just got like a little string up here now. So this guy's eight bucks if anybody wants him. Let me know. Whoops. I'm just trying to block people in my chat. Bad egg. Oh my goodness. So those are the hard goods that I have without me dipping into stuff I've shown before. I don't have a bunch of new stuff. I think I have stuff that you guys haven't seen, but it's on, like, the other side. So I'm going to show you guys some more stones, and then I'm going to um, show you some jewelry. I'm sorry. My brain is all over the place. I'm trying to focus, I promise. All right. I'm back. Sorry. Oh, good. Hello. Yeah, all right. Do you need another minute or so? Yeah, nope, no rush. <clears throat> um, I don't even know what to have you read. Um, I'll show this bowl real quick and then I'll throw it back over to Gina. This is a clear quartz bowl. And it kind of it reminds me of like Rutil quartz, but I don't know if that's what that is in there. It is kind of a cute shape. This guy's 20 bucks. I got some good deals on some bowls. Usually my bowls are like 35 to 50, depending on what it is. So if you want some bowls, I've got a couple that are pretty good price right now. Just let me know. Got that guy. And I'm going to pass it on over. Thank you, Beck. I'm going to pass it on over to Gina. And pick a baby yoga from a show. Michelle said I can pick one. Yeah, but he's kind of ugly. No, he's not. He is. Disrespect. I have some rose quartz palm stones. And I was going to start them at 10 choice. Starting bid 10. One's more like triangular shaped and the other one is more oblong. I like the smaller one. Thanks, Buck. That's <laughs> that's what Gina and, and Michelle yeah. said earlier. Hey, Buck. Long time no see. She has rose quartz palm stones. Oh, hey, Patty. Neighbor Patty. Thank 
you, Jess. I have a hat. Oh, you're not gonna My hemp hat. All right, you want something a little smaller? I got these guys. I can start these guys at six. Choice. Six starting bid choice. The longer one is more pink. This one is a little lighter pink. It's very, very light pink. And it's got some iron inclusions in there. The yellow. Some smaller rose quartz. All right. Well, if you're interested, just let me know. That was my two. Well, in case you just joined, I showed this earlier, blue kyanite on quartz, big, beautiful chunk for 25. This was 20, angel aura heart. I showed some mushies, they were 10 and 12 green fluorite and really light rose quartz. They were 10 and 12. Uh, fossilized starfish showed these earlier. These were 10. And I have these really pretty fluorite specimens, blue fluorite specimens. They're 13. You guys are so quiet tonight. Is it because it's super late? Probably. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. It's crickets in here, man. It's only 1 a.m. Well, I just got jewelry now. All right. Well, that was my turn. But the party don't stop. No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Anna? Didn't say it's after one mass of the pumpkin. Hey, Anna. Mm -hmm. I know, but we've only been on for 43 minutes. We're not leaving yet. <laughs> hey, Denise. Hey, Denise. Okay. So We're scared. <laughs> Why are you scared? Don't be scared. Elizabeth, that just made me giggle. I'm sorry. What are you scared of? I I genuinely love everyone, and girl, I've only I've only yelled at you twice. <laughs> I thought you were talking to me. I was like, no, that's not. No, that's I well, I didn't, I didn't yell. I just got I was just a little aggressive a couple times. It happens, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. I do it to everyone. Just means I'm comfortable with you. <laughs> and she says, me too. Yes. I usually always apologize if I, if I like, notice that I do it or whatever. But sometimes you got to call me out on it. And I'm like, oh, I did that, didn't I? All right. I have some red tiger's eye. And uh, I'm surprised you guys didn't claim any of these yet. They're gorgeous. Oh, are so, pretty so these are red tiger's eye worry stones. Maybe one day, but I don't. I don't know, man. I don't. <laughs> I need more time with you. 
I always take every well because dude the one day I don't take what you say seriously you're gonna be serious and then you're gonna be mad at me <laughs> I swear um so these are eight dollars a piece they are red tigers I worry stones and I've got three for you to choose from this is number one these are literally so gorgeous I was surprised nobody got any but I did do my video like super fast Oh, I have something you guys might like. I've got little pieces of stone for like four bucks. Like three or four bucks. Do you want some three or four dollar stones? That was number one. Here's number two. They're like, um, they're like smaller worry stones, basically. They're like, they're like a little bit bigger than this. They're perfect, um, for your pockets and your bras and things like that. This is number two. And this is number three. These are so pretty. Someone was asking for me for something like this, and I don't remember who it was. Another gorgeous. I don't know, but I like the mahogany color. Yeah, they're they're super red. They're really nice red tigers there. They they look creamy. I didn't know a stone could look creamy, but it's I'm not sure that it looks right creamy. It almost it looks like it would be silky if you touched it, like how silk moves, um, like under light, but it's not. Creamy. It's not silk. <laughs> creamy. I don't think I've ever heard someone. Describe a raw, no, like creamy. <laughs> I, I'm gonna go grab those smaller stones to show you guys. Uh, but the last thing I'll show here, and then I'll send it back over to her, and then I'll go get another thing. I just have just get it, but I don't. You don't know what. How much was the tigers that I didn't put the price? Oh, they're eight dollars each. All the worry stones are eight bucks. They are all eight bucks. And then oh. she says, give me one you pick. All right, girlfriend, I got you. I'm going to get you an extra creamy one. <laughs> this is a moonstone sphere. It's 70 bucks. It's got a giant blue flash here if I could find it and show you. I think it's 70. It's 70, right? There we go. So it's got a big blue flash here. Like it, It's like this whole thing is blue flash. And then I actually just found another piece of flash on it. Where is it? Here it is. It also flashes right here on the other side. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. But I found some more flash on it. I was super surprised about it. I knew there was some more flash on here, but I couldn't find it for whatever reason. So it's got that huge blue flash. Hey, Mama! And then this is the size of it on there. This is the Rainbow Moonstone. It's the last piece of Moonstone I have. Um, the, like, the white Moonstone. And I'm not going to get any more of it because of how expensive it is. So if you do want this or you want it eventually, let me know. Oh, God. I almost dropped it. Oh, I saved it. Oh, my heart! It fell out of my chest! Oh, Lord. At least you caught it. Alright, here's Gina. <laughs> oh, my toe <laughs> broke. Ow. All right, we need a... Hi, Elizabeth. <laughs> that was really creamy. I got some little mushies. I got Opalite, Green Aventurine, and Dragon Bloodstone, and they're $4 each. Bro, these are both. If anyone wants any, they have two opalite, two green aventurine. One's a little darker, and two those, dragon bloodstone. Are those little mushrooms? They're little mushies. They're four dollars each. Hi, Sandy. Bro, these are both so creamy. I don't know which one to do. I I think that all my opinion. Yeah. Stop saying that. That one's got a really good flash. 
this one. I'm gonna give her this one. That I think that was the best. Is that the one I said you should give her? Yeah, but that one's got hematite in it. Ooh, this one might be best. I'm gonna be the very best. Dude, Dude, are, you you? are you coming in for the mushies? Is that what you mean? Dude, Mama, yeah. we don't have any dragons. Dragon Bloodstone? Oh, think, she does like Dragon Bloodstone. Okay. I think she wants to yep. go with the Dragon Bloodstone. Cool, thank you. Yeah, she seashell combs. Elizabeth, do you want the one with the hematite running through it or no? They're all creamy. <laughs> <laughs> Silky. Hey, Sandy. Hey, Lana. Hey, Lana. Hey. All right, Elizabeth, you just let me know if you want hematite or no hematite. It's just a nice little pocket that goes through it. I'm gonna go grab those other things. Oh my, mm, my spine. Thank you all, Denise. Denise wants a green one and a white one, please. All right, thank you, Denise. Can you just let me know if you want the darker green or the lighter green? If you have a preference, just let me know. Thank you. Two mushies left if anyone wants any. Uh, green and opalite left. One of each left. All right, I'm going to put the darker one in your bag unless you tell me otherwise. Denise, thank you. Yep, one sec. Sorry. I'm just bagging those up. Green Aventurine and Opalite. Opalite is a man-made stone. Those two are left, and they're four each. Just let me know. Next, I'm going to show something for adults only. They're peens. They're $8. They're all clear quartz. I have five available. Five clear quartz available, little peens. They're $8. This is the after dark auction, you know. <laughs> Kara, the opalite is man-made. This one's man-made right here. It has like a rainbowy iridescence similar to opal. It's like man-made opal. Opalite, it's called. So uh, clear quartz peens are $8. Five available. Sandy. Hey, Sandra. <laughs> All right. Well, if anyone's interested, just let me know. <laughs> and I still have those two mushies left.
<laughs> oh, Sandy. Yeah, I'm back. Okay, I'm all set. Thank you. All right. So if oh, that's Christy. <laughs> so if anybody else wanted, oh, did Elizabeth tell me which ones you wanted? She's a tiger's eye. She just whatever I think. Creamy. So whatever I think. Um. She said you pick, but then I saw her put tiger eye, red tiger eye. Yeah, I know she wants that, but I'm picking which one. Oh. She's got like three to two. I don't know if hematite's your favorite though. I really like it. Like I like the inclusion, so it's cool to me. I guess pretty neat. Okay, so if anybody wants a tiger eye stone, I've got two left. They're eight dollars a piece. They are red, red tigers eye worry stones. They're eight bucks. If you want one, let me know. I'm gonna ponder over which one I'm gonna pick. Okay, I'm getting my. I'm going to let you decide what I show next. I have stone bracelets, like bangles. Come on, all. Am I really? <laughs> Joanne. <laughs> okay. So, I have uh, a couple things for you to choose from. I got some stone bangles that I can show you. I've got Jinghai Jade, uh, some like kind of like Carnelian Agate, and then some Terahertz, which is this stuff. Right, Gina? That's what it's called, Terahertz? Yep. How much are they? So, these are solid bangles. Um, nice. I'd have to look at my sh sheet. They're not too much, I think. That... The terahertz might have been the most expensive, but I think they're like twenty. And then the other one's like fourteen and either twelve or sixteen a piece. So the most expensive ones are twenty, and then the other two are, are cheaper. Thank you, Lana. What? Oh, I found the thing. Magic. Can I see the jade? So let me know. Let me know if you want to see those or if you want the um the smaller like uh thumb stones. We'll call them thumb stones. So I can do the thumb stones or the bangles. I will eventually show them both, but if there's one that you particularly want to see first, let me know. And then I also found uh I have like it's either a Vaseline glass fairy lamp. It's like a mini fairy lamp. And then I also have a really cool uh, piece of brass, and it's a mouse and a mouse trap. Both of those things I got at an antique store, though, so they're a little bit more expensive. But they're gorgeous pieces, which is why I picked them up. <laughs> hey, whatever you took it out of, put it back. I've shown them the straws before. No takers. Okay, I'm going to show you guys the little guys. We're gonna do the little, the little baby guy, and then I can be set up for the bangles because I have to give like measurements and stuff like that. Oh yeah, I have discovered that they are indeed glass. So I was drinking out of it in my water cup. Oh, she chunks fell out because then I hits it, hit it. So I shook it a little bit. What you broke it? You're, would you take another one because your straw's in the car? No, no, my. Well, hang, hang on. I got it out of the car. I didn't leave it in there. It was in the car when I got home. I sat on it. And that's not what? Okay. So these are um I'm gonna do three dollars. So these are three dollars a piece. I'm gonna tell you what material I have. I have two of each right now. Um but I potentially have more. It just depends. They're three dollars each. They're little thumb stones. And here is it like compared to the size of my thumb? It's like a thumbprint stone. 
Well, if you just hang on a second, I can talk to you. But I have to, I got to do this while it's my turn and then I can meet again. So, option number one is kind of like this carnelian-y orange agate. It's option number one. Number two, I've got green adventurine. Number three, I believe this is blue appetite. Not a hundred percent sure though. Number four is gonna be sodalite. Number five, black obsidian. Right? Yep, that's black obsidian. So one, two, three, four, five. Number six is rose quartz. Number seven is opalite. Number eight is kiwi. Number nine is clear quartz. Number 10 is some picture jasper. Mm -hmm. Number 11 is Mahogany Obsidian. That is not Mahogany Obsidian. I don't know what that is. Is this Mahogany Obsidian? I think so. I think this is number 11. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. Yep, that was number 11. Number 12 is whatever this stone is. Number 12. Looks like serpentine. Everything that's green is serpentine. <laughs> it really does. <laughs> that's number 12. Sandy, Sandy's in for seven. Number seven. Oops. Number 12. And then number 13 is lab. This one's got some blue flash. Are you sure you don't just want to wait a minute? You want to go to bed? All right, good night. I'll see you tomorrow. So the other side of that one doesn't have any flash, but the first side did. Okay. Um, and then, then I've got this kind of looks like Golden Healer, but I don't know if that's what it is. It also could just be a uh, Yellow Adventuring. And then the last one is Black Moonstone? No. What's that other stone? It's not Black Moonstone and it's not Kesara. Is there another one? Well, those two are like in two different families, so I'm not sure what you mean. No, maybe this is. No, this is Black Moonstone. They both have like the flashy bits. Did you mean larvacite? Maybe. This is probably larvacite. So. Yeah, it does look more like larvacite. So the last one is larvacite. Which I confuse with black moonstone sometimes. Okay, does anybody want anything else or does Sandy just want number seven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, which is opalite. So I do have one more opalite left. Sandy, do you prefer a clearer one or a more milky one? This one is more milky. This one is more clear. Just tell me clear or milky. And then if anybody else is interested, let me know. No, All right, you got it. Um, Nina Lover Denise says, Can I see the kiwi, please? You sure can. I've got this one. Call that number one. And then I've got this one, which you'll call number two. I've got two of each. Hmm.
Just let me know if you want him or if anybody else wants him. And then my second item I'm going to show real quick is this guy. He is a $30 star and it is a vintage brass piece. It is a mouse trap with a cute little mouse on it. And then you can also move this. So you can have it staggered or staggered however you want. And then here is the bottom. You want number two, Nino? I got you. Here it is compared to the size of my hands and my face. Which is a beautiful brass piece. Sandy is asking, what was the cream color thing you had? Did I have a cream color one? I've got like an orangey kind of carnelian. And then I've got this guy. So I've got this guy. He is a $30 start for the brass mouse. I don't know if he's, if he's antique, but I know he's vintage. So he is quite gorgeous. He's got some good... Uh, some good heft to him so let me know if anyone's interested in my mouse and I'm sandy, throw Nina up. both of those stones you showed all right sandy i got you got them all stacked up right there and here's gina nope that's christy there's gina <laughs> all right i got some sphalerite towers there's three different sizes the prices are 12 23 and 45. I know it's hard to remember. The $12 one. Oh, I have two purples and a more yellow brown sphalerite. That's the smallest one. This one's 12. This is a more expensive material. A yellowish brown sphalerite tower. Hey, Cha-Cha, welcome back. Break time again. <laughs> Here's a $23 one. It's the purple one. One of the purple ones. Okay. It does have small jerseys on it. Again, this one's 23 Little jersey pockets in there. And then the big one is 45. Hey kitty, please don't jump over there. I'm gonna kick his ass, come on dude. That's really expensive and old. Miranda, um, Nina Lover's asking if you got her order. She wanted the second kiwi. She said, can I have two, please? Yes, that's number two, right? Yeah, I think Does she mean quantity two? I don't know. I thought she meant she wanted number two. Okay. If you don't mind clarifying, Denise. Yeah. If you, if you want both of them, I'll just throw the other one in your bag. I just... I assumed you wanted number two since I numbered him. Oh, my feet are toasty, my friends. Yeah, they hurt. Ow. These are the Spellerite Towers I have. If there's any interest, just let me know. And then I have three um, blue calcite spheres left. They're all $12. If 
anyone's interested in a blue calcite sphere. $12, buy it now. They're all, they're all $12. Oh, did I get to order? No, I'm sorry, um, Denise, what did I miss? Denise, I'm sorry, I don't see anything for... The last time I saw you write something was when you were claiming a mushroom for me. Mushrooms? <clears throat> She said yes, number two. These are 12 if there's any interest. Yeah, Denise, just let me know, please. I'm sorry. I don't know what order you're talking about. Well, that was my two. Um, can you just uh, keep going for a minute? Sure. I showed these clowns earlier. Um, they were six. This guy I can do for six. But this guy I can do for four because I actually discovered he's got some chipping by his feet. So I can do this guy for four if anyone's interested. And he's got a little chip on his umbrella right there. He's got like a coin slot, but he doesn't open on the bottom. But they're both vintage. This is a six dollar one. Did these earlier in case anyone missed them. Okay, Sandy. I can look out for those. Um, I still have some Prey Night Spheres. Beautiful green Prey Night. I love Prey Night. They're 18 and 24. $18 one. How do you spell that one? <laughs> we are E H N I T E. There's a nice little crystal hole there. I wouldn't call it a jersey pocket. It's more like a crystal pocket. With some green epidote in there. Looks like rutile. How much was it? Uh, they're 18 and 24. And Nino Lover, the last thing I saw you wrote was, Gina, did you get my order? Yes, number two. That's it. Nothing and after that. And then now we see, can anyone see my messages? Yeah, that's it. I think maybe some of your messages are just not showing up or something. Oh, YouTube is so weird like that sometimes. And this is the bigger one. This is 24. I know. It's super, it's super frustrating. So some nice black tourmaline in there. Oh, Patty, you want the pre night? Thank you, Patty. There might be something that you're putting in there that's making um, YouTube flag it. So look at what you're trying to put, and maybe um, it just doesn't like one of the words. Because that happens as well. Yeah. Thank you, Patty. I got you down for that. Thank you. And if anyone wants a $24 one, just let me know.
Oh, uh, Nina, lover Denise would like to order a peen still. Oh, were you writing in the other word? Maybe that's why. Is it okay? <laughs> hey, and <laughs> is it okay if I just pick you one at random, or do you want to pick one out of the five? They're all pretty close to each other. <laughs> they all look equally like not none is really any more clear than the other. That's okay with you. Just let me know. Like this one, I like. Candy, well. <laughs> she wants the weenies. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Well, I mean that 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 would do it. That would make it so it didn't go through. Depending on how you worded it. <laughs> yeah. If you didn't put P E E N, it may have removed it. Yeah, because I don't think anybody put anything <laughs> for them. So, yeah, we didn't oh. see if you did. Sorry about that, Denise. <laughs> Got you down for that. Thank you. <laughs> Teeny weeny peeny. I still have this gorgeous garden quartz chunky tower. I know, right? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, this guy is 35. <laughs> Jeez, that was hard. Beautiful garden quartz. A lot going on in there to look at. There's also like a um, like a chevron pattern kind of near the top inside of there. You, you may not have uh, mentioned this <laughs> <they're> very funny. <laughs> How much was the tower? Uh, this guy is 35 garden quartz. Expensive material. Very cool looking though. <laughs> One of my favorites. Well, there's so much going on in there. It's like you it see is. something different every time you look. There's so much to look at. It's like a whole other world in there. Yeah. I need to look at these in the light. Trying to flashlight up to them. Oh, that looks cool. Jeez, look at that. It looks like you're looking underwater. Yes. <laughs> so cool. It's a nice, chunky, stubby tower. Frog's eye view. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, I can show a couple. All right, thank you. I just had to move some stuff around. Okay, so if you missed him earlier and you want to see him, I've got this vintage brass piece. It's a nice mouse and a mouse trap. He is thirty dollars. He's really cool. And then I've got this really cool old fairy lamp, and it's like a mini fairy lamp. And I think this is Vaseline glass. It's 
or it's like weird white or weird green milk blocks. I don't know. And he's also a Fenton. Which everybody and their mom's been looking for. So this is a Fenton fairy lamp. And it looks like this. And I'm going to do him for 40 It'll be a $40 start. Is that top? That's beautiful. It is. He's super gorgeous. And then he has his Fenton sticker on the inside here. And he, I don't know if he glows. He looks like he would, though. And then he also um, has, a, he stamped Fenton, like, down here, like, in the glass as well. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it's on there, too. So he's double marked, and he's for sure Fenton. I know uh, some Fenton fairy lamps were going for hundreds of dollars on eBay. I don't know if they're still all the craze, but... I found this guy, and I just thought he was so beautiful that someone might really, really love him. So I grabbed him. So I went to um, I went to a little antique, like a little antique store that's it's like a couple towns away, but I popped in there. It's really thick. It's quite thick. It's beautiful. And it's got that, the edge where you can see through the edge part. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but I can see it on my light. I don't know if that counts for this. I think that helps age it. If Teresa was still awake, she could help me a little bit here. Yeah, that, oh, that way looks stupid. Definitely goes this way. All right, if anybody wants it, let me know. Put him down. Um, no, it's not maybe Fenton. It's definitely Fenton. <laughs> no, I meant maybe Vaseline glass, not Fenton. Oh! <laughs> yeah, because I don't remember what Vaseline glass is. I feel like this is it, but also I could be wrong. But it's definitely a Fenton piece. So if anybody wants that, let me know. And I will show you the world. Shining, shimmering, splendid. Tell me, princess. Now, when did you last let your heart decide? I, I don't know what else to show you. Hang on. Twisting, twisting my body. Mm. I can tell you I'm, I'm, <gasps> I'm all pumpkin. I hit my finger. That did not feel good. Hi. Mm. I don't want to show. I've got this guy. He's been hanging around here for a while. This is um, the last moss agate tower I have. He's nice and tall. A little bit skinnier. We'll do sixteen dollars on this guy. He was. I was asking twenty. Which is definitely a fair price. He's a beautiful moss agate piece. He's nice and tall. He's got lots of cute wow. little clear portions. Looks like a galaxy. Gorgeous. I really shoved my finger over there and it hurts super bad. I like looking at him through the light. It's hard for me to show it, but I can see all the gaps in there through my light and stuff. You can really see in there. He's got nice, uh, nice agate spots that you can look in there, but he's also like a super um, mossy green color, like that dark mossy green color. That's what he is. Got a beautiful tip on there. It's gorgeous. I, I, keep him. Thinking, I keep thinking galaxy when I look at it because you know how they mix colors when they're making galaxy stuff. That yeah. 
All right, that's my too. If you want me, saying I showed, let me know. Gina. <laughs> All right, well, speaking of moss agate, I have this really pretty um, sphere, and it's a $22 start. It has uh, several druzy pockets on it. The 22 start. We have Druzy, pretty large Druzy pocket right there. Some little ones next to it. Another more there. Two more there. And then just tons of window quartz, window Druzies all over. It's just stunning. Kara is wondering if there's any clothes. Uh, I don't have any clothes for tonight, Kara. I don't know if Miranda does. Uh, I've got some next to me, but I don't want to mess with it tonight. I don't know how much longer I can go. I know, I'm exhausted too. I'm sure, Gina, I'm sure you're tired too. Oh, yeah. Yep. I'm game for whenever you want to close shop. <laughs> trying to get those druzy sparkles. They it's weren't like sparkly a, in person. They don't like seem to want to sparkle on camera. It's like the sun on the planet. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name of that stone I asked you about? Larvakite? Larvakite. We got a spidey hole. Wonder what's living in there. Elizabeth. Shell spiders. It's shell spiders. <laughs> yeah, it's really it's a really stunning um I speak of the devil. Elizabeth, I was saying there's spidey holes. Got a moss agate uh, sphere. 22 start. It's got druzies on it. They're a little camera shy. There's some more there. Those are druzies. And it's just covered in just lots of window druzy all under here. The swirls of mossiness. And those are druzy pockets. Yes, spidey holes. <laughs> Those are jerseys. You twisted her arm. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> There's no other interest, though. Sold to, El sold to Elizabeth. <laughs> Thank you. It's really beautiful. We're just chilling. We're just chilling. Thank you. It's so pretty. <laughs> Thank you again. And my second item, I have these <laughs> the spidey holes. <laughs> yeah, the spidey holes are even better when they're filled with druzy. <laughs> These are aura coated uh, quartz clusters and they're $4. Buy it now choice. They're $4 each. We can call this number one, number two, and number three is the lightest. <laughs> Elizabeth, I, I fear that day. Can you imagine all the exotic bugs that have come over in stone holes? <laughs> I don't really even want to talk about spiders. Okay, <laughs> I was shopping today at Lucid and Teresa thing. Yeah, I, I was. It was like thirty minutes till the end. And I swear 
a freaking brown recluse spider crawled up by my hand. Ooh, that's and scary. I lost it. Oh. I mean, it, it kind of, my laptop is here and it, something was telling me, you need to clean up your mess because that's what happened. <laughs> and, and it got killed. I'm sorry, but it looked like a brown recluse. And I was worried that it was, and yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's scary. These cute little clusters are just $4. If anyone's interested, just let me know. That was my two. Okay. Cool beans. I hate oh, that. That is okay. sad. I like bumblebees too. Yeah, I got like um carpenter bees out there like big bumblebees. Yes. And oh, they're like little toddlers they'll run around so sweet. And stop in the air and just look at you and if you're not looking they'll run into you. Yeah. But I hate when they fight and then one is like on the, the ground dying or something. So. Yeah, that's sad. Like, why you guys have fight? You're too cute. <laughs> in case you missed it, I've got this button fairy lamp for $40. And I also have this uh, vintage brass mouse and mouse trap for 30 And then now I'm going to show some bangles and measure them um i can't i can just measure them across i don't know what kind of opening you need so the terahertz which are these they kind of look like um hematite kind of these ones are bigger these bangles are 20 dollars a piece and for example this one has a two and a quarter opening, two and a quarter inches. I don't know if there's any that fit my hands. They've got two and a quarter or 58 millimeters. Does that tell, is that the, the thing of inside? Yeah. So I don't know if there's anything above 58, 56. That one's not marked. Looks so damaged, probably because I dropped it 10 times. Lord, this one's almost two and a half. I don't know what this one is. So I don't know what kind of openings you guys need. Yeah, these are mostly two and a quarter, and then there's one that's a little bit smaller. So they're not quite two and a half inches. They are two and a quarter inches, and then um, there's one that's a bit smaller than that. If you need it, these are twenty dollars a piece. And these are the terahertz ones, which Dino knows all about this stone. I don't know anything about it. Or it's like a man-made material thing, I think. Ooh. So she'll have to give you the lowdown on it if she wants to. Or she can just be silent. <laughs> These are agate, and this one particularly, this one has a two and a half inch open. If I really tried, I could get this one on my hand, but I've got like wider hands. So this is an agate bangle, bangle and it's full stone. And I could almost get this one on, and this is the two and a half inch one. But like I said, I've got really wide hands. And if I did try hard enough, I could get it on, but I think it would be hard for me to get it off. So I could get it over my knuckle there, but it would hurt. Um, the agate ones are, um, let's see. I'll just do this. I'll do the, the green Jinghai Jade, and I think that's what that's called. And then the Agate, I'll do those for 16 a piece. Hmm. 
go to Ego ones I can do for 16 a piece. Again, that one has a two and a half inch opening. I'm going to see if any of them have any bigger ones than that. If you need a specific measurement across, let me know. This one is two and a quarter, and it's kind of like a peachy color. A nice peachy color. That one's super pretty. That one's two and a quarter. This one is two and a half again. And this one's more goldeny. So if you don't have any solid, uh, solid stone bangles, you should definitely get some. They're super cute and definitely good for you to wear. I've also got some solid rings coming. I don't know when those are going to be here. This one is also two and a half across, and it is like clear and yellow. A little bit thicker. Oh my goodness. Got it. We got that guy. Of course, I dropped it right on the freaking old freaking Fenton fairy lamp. Good job, Miranda. Goodness. Yeah, golden name. This is another one that's two and a quarter. This one's more of like a peachy kind of almost skin tony vibe there, but not super dark peachy. And there's two more that's like this. This one is two and a half inches. I don't know if any of these go over two and a half inches. And again, this one's more like golden yellow. And then there's one left. This one is... Two and a half as well. And this one's golden and yellow as well. Those are those guys. Do you know you want a terahertz? Does it m matter the dimensions on the inside? If if one's any bigger than the other, even by a pinch, mm -hmm. I'll take the bigger one. I think they're all two and a quarter. They're like all two and a quarter but one. Okay. How, does it fit your hand all right? No. <laughs> no, it's too small. I've got um I've got really wide hands right there though. Uh, this one's a pinch bigger. Oh, maybe. He's got some damage on him though. Let's see. Oh, don't fall. Does anybody want any of the agate ones while I'm going through and seeing if I can find one for you? <clears throat> <clears throat> I got a tear heart sphere. Very excited. Yeah, my my like my pinky, my pinky and my first hand here. Oh crap, Brandon! That thing looks tiny. It's very wide. <laughs> well, this one in particular is kind of is that one small, <laughs> but it, I've got like a really wide hand. All right. Well, it might just be a display. Oh, this one's a little bit bigger. <laughs> Denise asks, any I, green bangles? I do. I'm getting to those ones next. So I think this one's going to be your best, but it, it's a lot thicker, though. That's okay. So it says it's 58 millimeters, but I think it might be like 59. Okay. It's a pinch bigger. So thank you very much, beautiful lady. I'll put that one aside for you. If anybody else wants a terahertz, let me know, or an agate. Let me know. The terahertz are 20, and the agate and the green ones are 16 apiece. These are all the agates. And there's quite a few of these ones that are um, two and a half. These ones are a bit bigger. But two and a half inches so far is the biggest it's gone. Next time I order them, I'll have to be more specific about how big I need them. <laughs> I just ordered them and didn't get sizes. You know. All right. So the green ones, these are $16 a piece. I'll number them. 
Number one is almost two and a half. So number one's almost two and a half inches across. Number two. These take so long to measure. Number two is two and a half. And these ones are a little bit slicker. I could slip this onto my hand. Is this agate or centurine? Um, these are like jade. It's some kind of jade. So that's number two. Number three is also two and a half. And this one's a lot easier to slip in. That one goes right over my pinky so I could get this one on. So this one I could get on my body for sure. This is number three. Number four is almost two and a half inches, but not quite. That one I could probably squeeze on. This one has like more, it's like more slippery than the agate ones. That's number four. Number five. It's two and a half, two and a half inches, number five. Number six is a little over two and a half. So this one I could probably also get on. Yeah, I could slip that one on. And the last one, so that was one, two, three, four, five, six. Number seven, which is the last one, is a little over two and a half as well. And this one I could slip on as well. My hand hurts really bad from trying to shove all these bracelets on it, though. <laughs> That's the last one. And for reference, I'll measure across my hand. So my hand laying flat, not trying to contort it or anything, is three and three quarter inches. I have a wide hand. <laughs> it's like, it's a little over. It's between like three and a half and three and three quarters inches across my hand. Got those wide hands. <sighs> my bones hurt from trying to shove those smaller ones on. So like, I really got to squeeze to get those on. Gina, what's, what's the across your hand measure? Inch wise? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> not contorted not contorted so how yeah. so just just like with your fingers closed like that my fingers closed yeah like that and then just measure across this way cross like do i wrap it around the sides no just like the weight the, you know like the thing of it well going down to like my thumb knuckle is five inches roughly really the, one, the widest part, yeah, like kind of wrapping it a little bit, going around the curve. Well, I don't think, don't, well, don't wrap it. Well, you have, I just went gently went around the curve. <laughs> Was that the last thing that you're showing today? Yeah, your hands are wider than mine. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Yeah, your bracelet might just be, um, unless you can really contort your hand, your bracelet's going to be decoration. <laughs> you could use it as a sphere holder. You could put a sphere on it, though. Okay, yeah, I might just do that. I don't yeah. mind having Tara hurts in my house, so that's cool. I just like it. Yes. <laughs> uh, Sandra, it's um, the, uh, the green ones and the agate ones. I have them in bigger sizes. Uh, that quarter of an inch that, that we're losing on the Tara hurts really really does make a difference so if you have like I, I i have fairly small hands like i have i've never met anyone that has smaller hands than me at least not in person unless they were literally a child <laughs> so um but i've got like fat hands apparently <laughs> but i do have small hands and i can't i can't get the tear hurts on my hand except for maybe the one that gina's getting and that's if i really shove it so i don't want to break my finger to put it in there um if you want to you can measure across your hand and you could do the little crab thing and see how small you can make it and then measure it again. And then let me know what that is. And then I can tell you if I have one that'll fit you. Um, but uh, I'll be honest with you. If it's not going to fit, I'll tell you it's not going to fit. Because I don't want you to get something that you want to wear. 
and then uh, be disappointed that you can't. So if you guys want to measure yourselves and then hit me up and let me know, I have no problem with that. Um, if you guys end up not wanting any of them, then I'll list them. Like I'll list them with their measurements and stuff. So I'm not super concerned about it. Uh, I know stuff like this is pretty popular, especially online. So I'm not stressing. And we got home. Late, late Friday night because we had a wedding all day Saturday. Yesterday. No, Saturday. Yesterday is Sunday. And yesterday was Sunday. It's been a very long day. <laughs> all right, I'm going to pop it back over to Gina. Um, do you want to keep showing? I guess I should have asked you. There you go. It's up to you. And then, uh, oh, Denise and anybody, if you wanted any of the green bangles, let me know, please. Um, I don't, I don't care. I'm, sur I'm surprised nobody wants this beautiful Fenton fairy lamp. I know, right? You guys surprise me sometimes, man. <laughs> Travel lives me out this far. Okay. Yeah, we, uh, we, uh, we drove 10 hours to, um, to North Dakota for a funeral. And then we were there for three hours. And then we drove 10 hours all the way back. Stopped oh. the house for a second so Andy could grab something. And then we went to the hotel that we had to stay at for the wedding. Got up at between... We were supposed to get up at 8 a.m., but we didn't get up until... Like, we got up late. I think we got up at, like, 9.15. Um, and then we were almost late because we had to be to the place to get dressed at 10 a.m. Because Andy was in the wedding. Uh, and then we were there uh, with the bridal party and at the wedding and everything until 10 p.m. at night. And then we came yeah. home. Yeah. It was a lot. <laughs> and then uh, the next day I had to go to my mom's house to get our dogs, to talk to her for a bit. And uh, then I had to rush back home to finish cleaning my house. And then uh, my in-laws came, so Andy's family. They came, they got here yesterday around like, what, seven or eight or something like that? Around eight, like just before dark, so maybe between eight and nine. Yeah. And um, they'll be here until like Friday, I think. Hmm. Okay, so yeah. where are we supposed to measure our hands again? Okay, Denise, just let me know, girl. You know, you can just send me an email. You're supposed yeah, to right. contort it as small as you can, and then like measure around the widest part. Mm -hmm. And it's usually like where your knuckle is. That's usually I know where I try to squeeze it over. Yeah, because they usually get like they get like stuck on your knuckle. Yeah. Yeah. Denise, I know you like green. Did you see that I had a prey night sphere? <laughs> Look, this guy's twenty four. Okay. 24 for pre night spear. <laughs> Have the right measuring tape speed. Yeah, it's, it's been a mess. And then last night, in the middle of the night, uh, we found out that, that his best friend, that my husband's best friend's mom passed away. So it's been a long, it's been a long everything. Yeah, crazy. Oh, I still have this uh, lab skull, bigger lab skull. This guy's 25. He doesn't have much flash at all. I struggle to find flash on him. He's still lab 25. Oh, okay, cool, please. Just let me know. I do have green towers too. I still have this green fluorite. This guy's 35. It's a big chunky tower. I still have um oh my green, green epidote with pyrites. These are 18. Got it. Sorry. Old stone 18. Fluorite 25. Rainbow fluorite. It's got a lot of green in it. Green fluorite for 17. As far as green goes, I got a tr tree agate tower, a big one for 32. 
So the Moss Agate Tower, bigger one for 28. And again, the Slab Skull is 25. Gonna try to make a two-hour mark and then that's it. Um, I'm just letting Gina go, and then I'm gonna show the uh, the couple radon mugs that I have here. If anybody wants them, then I'll be done. Okay, I can be done very, very, very soon. Yes. Yeah. This amethyst cluster for twenty-two. It was just a we uh, a weird late night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. It's a little strange. I'm gonna try to get this sticker off for you. Oh, that did not work out. Which is like fresh from the ground. Geo. Oh, amethyst. Very, very cool, unique cluster. It's very tall. Do you guys know that song? Um, I've been singing it all day. Well, there I go, go. Can't make a wife out of a hoe. Oh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> no, never heard of that one. It's been in my head all day. I can't get it out. <laughs> I have one anatomical heart left for 25. Last one. Red vein Jasper. Still have a K2 sphere. This guy is 26. K2, which is granite and azurite. Very powerful stone. Did you say 22? Yep. Oh, and I have, still have the bowl it's been sitting on. This guy was 12, I believe. A stone bowl. I'm using it to hold the K2. I'm not sure of the material. It's like kind of neon yellow in spots. I'm really just not positive. And I have more, but that is all I think I will show tonight. And if you saw anything that I showed earlier and you were interested, just let me know. <laughs> Gina. What? I was trying <laughs> to put your bracelet in this bag. <laughs> it doesn't fit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sitting here like, why won't you get in here? I'm like really trying to shove it, man. And it's like, no. <laughs> Alright, I got a bigger bag. I got all the BX, baby. So, ladies, measure your wrists. Let me know if you want some bangles. <laughs> and a goop ring's coming. And I got, I think I got, like, two of every size ring they had. Or something like that, so. Well, I'll have at least one of your sizes. So, this is New Beginnings. It's got yellow on the inside. New Beginnings, Ray Dunn mug. Brand new, 15 doll hairs. And then I've got the baby blue one that says free spirit. It is also 15. And then I've got one more. And it is the baby pink one that says mother of the bride. And then. I have, this is brand new. They are a pair of satin thong slippers. Um, and they've got beautiful colored butterflies on them. These are $15. And they're, uh, they go up to roughly a size 10. And they just say a woman's kind of like one size shoe. 
And here they are. There's like a little house slipper and they're satin. So they're a really nice gift uh, for yourself or for someone else. A wedding gift, like someone said earlier. They're just super cute. Love these guys. I've got this weird egg. It also has its tag attached. It's got like, um, like suede and corduroy and like some silk and satin and other things on the outside. It's a little egg. And then it's like a, an egg container with some uh, satiny kind of inside. And uh, this is $8. I've got the brass mouse trap for $30. The Fenton. Old. The old Fenton fairy lamp for $40. Um, and then for $20. I've got this big recipe box. It's in the shape of a birdhouse, and it folds down for your cards to go in there. And it's got all these beautiful fruits and stuff on it. And he's pretty big, and he's 20 bucks if you want him. And then I did show stones and things like that, but if you want those, you either have to watch the replay and let me know, or wait until I show them again, because you know I will. And uh, that's it for me right now tonight if there's anything i can get you anything you want let me know thank you guys for being here gina did you want to show anything else or were you 100 percent done no i'm good for the night thank you so much okay um gina when are you coming back um i don't have my agenda in front of me Is she's it... like never <laughs> i think it's like What's today? Monday? Is it Wednesday or Thursday? I forgot. <laughs> yeah, today's Monday. I don't know. I don't. I don't have my my thing around me either. Come here, kitty. Come here. Oh, there's a big baby. Say hi. Oh, is that is that a fly? Night, everybody. I love you guys. Thank you for coming and showing up. It's two thirty in the morning. 3 30 here thank you guys so much <laughs> no and i kept everybody up pretty late um so thank you for being here and enduring with us and just hanging out and chilling if you bought something thank you and if you didn't buy something thank you for just being here i will be back on tomorrow night i think i'm by myself unless i can uh convince gina to come on with me i don't know i am gonna try to go on earlier tomorrow and it especially won't be this late at least and uh you know, I don't know how long I'm going to be on or what I'm going to show, but we'll figure it out. So, you know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Goodbye, guys. Thank you Thank for being you, everyone. here.